Are you fucking kidding me? Keemstar, the ultimate hypocrisy, has cried to YouTube about me making fun of his creepy ass dating a 20 year old. He called her fresh cheeks. Now we are suspended for a week. This after he lied and cried about me getting him suspended, which I had nothing to do with. Uh, you know, I should be jumping up and down happy, but I'm just not. I'm not happy, right? Just and he somehow knew this information before we did and posted it immediately, meaning he 100% was talking to YouTube about it. Imagine being this much of a hypocrite to you guys served two videos of Ethan Klein and Hila Klein and the H3H3 H3 podcast were taken down for violating terms of service of YouTube. Uh, him getting two strikes, I don't know. I can only guess, but I'm sure he... She's 20, so what? I mean, to be honest, it's like a, it's like a double whammy. You know what I mean? One, she's like super young in comparison to Keemstar, who's 40 years old. But also, two, she clearly has some issues if she's having sex with Keemstar, okay? So automatically, by virtue of like anyone having sex with Keemstar, that means that like they're being taken advantage of in some way. Because no one in the right mindset is having sex with Keemstar. You know what I mean? So, it's like, it's like doubly fucked up. She, she was six when he was 26. Oh God, stop. Oh. Probably can't upload for a while. Can't stream. And uh, quite frankly, he deserves it. It's well overdue. Uh, the stuff that is said on that podcast to bully and harass other creators would never fly on anyone else's channel. You know, it's been suspect and alleged that Ethan Klein played a big role in getting my- I guess to be fair, in that situation, it's like, it doesn't matter if she's 20. Because like, is consensual relationship with Keemstar even a possibility? I think not. So he probably thought like, eh, fuck it. Like, no matter what happens, it's like, you can't add on to it. You know what I mean? I guess that's what his, uh, his, his reasoning was. He's mentally 14, though. If anything, she should be going to prison. <laughs> I think Keem and Fuz go way back in Call of Duty, so I bet he helped Keem out. Liberals will literally hunt Whiz? individual misogynists down before addressing any institutional or systemic issues, SMH. Like, I just want Keemstar to be normal, dude. It would be so nice if he could just, like, one day decide... He's going to be like a fucking good person rather than whatever kind of evil manifestation gnome that Four this has. fuck has been Video for his entire down, life. Giving me a warning on my channel, uh, getting Leafy's channel completely deleted. And if you go back and you look at Leafy's content. Like this is the one dude who's still keeping up the Gamergate vibes. And he's just been able to like keep that going. You know what I mean? Look at him still like, huh, I can't believe Leafy's channel got de deleted. It's like, dude, this guy was like talking about how he's going to do school shootings and shit. Yo, so apparently it's 10 months. And, and the reasons in which his long live channel long went down, long live for that is very tame to what happens on the H3H3 podcast. York York. I know many will look at this and see it as Keemstar versus Ethan Klein. And this is just another Everything story in the much. endless fight and the endless saga. It's much bigger than that. All right. That show has been harassing so many fucking creators, so many fucking YouTubers, right? And it would be fine if we had rules where we could talk shit back, bully back, harass back, but we can't. Everyone has to play by the fucking rules, and this guy doesn't have to. I don't understand. It's like literally all Keem does is everything he's complaining about right here. He's saying he wants a bully hunter. Keemstar has to call up a bully hunter, dude. You know, I wouldn't be surprised if more fucking videos uh, get taken down from him now that YouTube's actually doing something. Uh, I don't know why he was protected before and why this went on as long as it did. But I must say, I am, I guess, happy uh, that YouTube's finally doing something. This is well fucking deserved. Um, I don't know what more to say. I'm because I'm not happy. I'm still angry about it that it took this fucking long, but at least something's happening now, and he got two strikes. So, yeah. wait, is this real? Is he actually with fucking Susan Wajiki? No, right? No shot. 
she would never i've met her one time i met her at vidcon once like not for an extended period of time and just like in passing but there's no shot that he would ever fucking she would ever be around him h3 banner behind them head ass i don't fucking know man i don't know I don't know the nitty gritty, okay? I'm sorry that I don't know what fucking Keemstar's height is, okay? Was blessed with the new if anything, you're a fucking loser for knowing so that, I okay? How about that? Sub. Shut up. Glad I, can support I need a bully hunter right now from this fucking chat. Full of froggy friends hassle. I wonder what Ethan Klein said that, like, got him fucking banned. For a week that's insane then in a podcast with her he got a lot of flack for it because hey Ethan. team started calling him a sellout to youtube Ethan studio has been spamming their own spicy sponsor slander lately to be fair he trashed most podcasts relentlessly i mean dude yeah i think if i remember ethan said that if someone else dating the 20 year old keem would call them the pedophile word p word bully hunter is here he said, fuck them chatters. Fuck! Bully Hunter 821. 15, baby. He's here and he's hunting bullies, dude. Get get down, bullies. <laughs> Stream is not a joke. Bullyhunters.org stream is not a joke. He's going to come and knife you guys, dude. Watch out. In a CSGO game. Keemstar is dating a 20-year-old. He's 40. Right, I love go. that title, dude. Keemstar is dating a 20-year-old. He's 40. Let's get to the main <laughs> story, shall we? Oh, my God. He did not speak for an entire hour about this. Troll. You're supposed to be stealth, buddy. Bro, you literally do this, but worse? Okay, dude. That's you. I, dude, you guys make fun of me, but, like, I talk about shit for an hour when it's, like, I don't know, fucking bully hunters or something. And I tie it back to, like, I guess they could do that, too, with Keemstar. His podcast with Brother Banks they listen to is just wild. Dude, I love that. Are you kidding me? I love that. I love that podcast. M Mama's Basement or Mother's Basement or whatever. You guys, you know I love FaZe Banks. Like, that's never going to change, okay? Whenever FaZe does some, like, dumb shit, I'm like, oh my god, I hope FaZe Banks is not involved. I very openly mention this, okay? He's the best. He's the best. I love him. You've literally spent two hours watching 20 minutes of this video. Okay, shut up. They played a podcast of him with Banks talking meat-headed shit about fucking new 20-year-old cheeks. Oh, my God. Ugh. Oh, God. Okay, let's see. boys less, making less eye contact with them, and really training. Okay, I kind of want to know what she looks like, though. What, is, what does Keemstar's girlfriend look like? Like, how badly am I going to be upset? <laughs> dude, he posted this photo and someone said, Daddy and daughter time, dude. Oh, no. Now Kim's going to cry to Twitch to get you suspended? Yeah, dude. Okay. To talk about... Keemstar bullying him. Does Keemstar have a direct pipeline to Susan Wojcicki? Read, this is not what he got banned for. He had a mock call in of his girlfriend and got banned for that. It's not on the video. They took it down. Yeah. She has to be in it for the money. Hope she's mulling him good. Look up the definitions of ASPD. What? You mean antisocial personality disorder? Hello, Hassan. This is Bully she was Hunter born in 2001. I have been summoned fuck? on behalf of Keemstar. Please stop making fun of him and his daughter wife. 
Thank you. Did someone say daughter wife? Oh, God. She's the OG stay-at-home daughter. She grew up watching him? Oh, ew, dude. What do you think the requirement for harassment would be on YouTube? Like, Leafy was banned for making, like, seven videos about Pokey? I was going to call Dude, you. I don't know, man. I'll know it when I see worse, it. So instead, he'll just say thanks, parasocial father figure hassle. They met at a fan meetup? Dude, I think the nastier part of that is that he has fans. Like, now, I mean, look, if you're a fan of Keemstar, then yeah, you deserve to date Keemstar. So good on Keemstar, honestly, literally, like, straight up. Sorry, it's just the truth, bro. If you're out and about and you're like, I'm going to go to a fucking Keemstar meetup, like, yeah, then, then that person should not be dating anyone else other than Keemstar. You know what I mean? He has a 13-year-old daughter. You guys will never... I know. I know it's weird, okay? I know. She plays Minecraft. Am I going to jail? Oh my god. Oh my god. That's flex. Why? Why is he making it even creepier, dude? He's like... He's like so proud of himself. God, he's so grimy. Keep starting. He's the call of bully hunters. Yeah, the internet is ruthless, dude. If you like this video, please subscribe and hit that bell so you don't miss out on any future videos. <laughs>